<laughs> I have been on a hunt for a while. And, you know, I think it was because I saw all these pictures on Instagram of these beautiful women with these amazingly huge sky-high eyelashes. And I said, wow, look at those lashes. And they were all talking about this particular brand of mascara and I had to get it. So if you're curious, stay tuned. What I'm talking about is, and I, I actually did a story on YouTube. You know, YouTube has that the story clips where you have a 60 seconds or under, you can talk about something. Well, anyways, I talked about how I've been hunting for this stuff. So I keep watching and keep seeing these ads on Instagram, these ads on Facebook, and these ma amazingly beautiful women with these honking huge eyelashes. And I'm thinking, that mascara sounds awesome. And I kept hearing it's a dupe for this, it's a dupe for that. So I went to look for it. And this is the Maybelline. And I, I will have to say, I think Maybelline, out of all the drugstore brands, hands down, has such a huge variety of mascara that you could just get totally lost looking at Maybelline mascaras. So anyways, I started to look for the Lash Sensational Sky High Mascara. I couldn't find it anywhere. If I found it, the shelves were empty or it had a color I didn't want. All the blacks were out. All of the, this this one here is the waterproof, but I, on my eyes right now, I have the one that's not waterproof, the regular one. I was like really shocked that I could not find this mascara anywhere and I was really freaking out because I wanted to try it. And I finally found it. I actually found it, it was on back order until sometime in February in on Amazon and um, Walgreens kept selling out so I finally got it I ordered in Walgreens and Walgreens often has sales sometimes you buy one full price get half price whatever and you know I have points and I have coupons so I ordered it into the store to get it and I'm gonna superimpose a picture of the shelf because there was only like two left I couldn't believe it. the place was cleaned out because I had my two. So I ordered one, a regular one, not a waterproof one. And I ordered them both in the I think, very black shade. The waterproof I haven't opened yet. I wanted to see how it would compare to the other mascaras that I've tried. I mean, I have like a really, a Clarins is my high end that I really like. I, I got that one. I, I, um, I reviewed that one from Octoly. I love, love, love that mascara. It has knocked uh, my It Superhero off the shelf for me, and I used to love It Superhero, but I just thought the Clarins mascara was, was so much better. So I, for drugstore, I've been using Essence, because you cannot beat the price of the Essence, I have it here, Lash Princess, you can't. And it, to me, it does really well. It holds up really well. I really like it. So I bought this and I said, hmm. the first thing I noticed when I opened it up, and this is used, was the wand is really kind of soft. And I said, so I thought, wow, that's a little wiggly wandy thing, right? And I was wondering how that was going to be. But it actually did not bother me at all. I was able to put it on my eyes. So this picture, excuse my ugly eyes, but this picture is where I have one coat on one eye and nothing on the other eye. And then the next picture, you're going to see I have one coat on each eye. And then when I was done that, when I was done the one coat on each eye, I looked at it and I thought, wow, it really built up a good amount of, I think, length for me. So the the length was definitely there. The volume was there. I compared it to my Essence, which is cheaper in general because Essence, I don't know, it doesn't cost that much. It was like maybe four something for this. And this on sale was about seven something because I bought two. I had a coupon and all that. I think you can get this as high as 12 bucks, uh, but average about eight or nine. So this is definitely more than this. But I will tell you that I actually like this one better than this one. And I didn't think I would say that. I thought this actually built up my lashes better 
and this is not waterproof so I was like worried about how would it hold up all day so this is day three of using this I said four maybe four I don't know day three or four of using this and I have and I'm not using the waterproof one I haven't even touched that one yet and um it, it held it on my eyes and I know it's all subjective. I was watching Jennifer Loves. She did a collab with Amali and Fab and Glam and Natalie and she was talking about a top that she loved that she got from Amazon and I said oh, I gotta get that top. It was v-neck. It was she said it was warm and cozy and, and all of that and I so I ordered the top. I actually have it on and it is a v-neck and I love it. It fits it fits wonderful. It is long sleeves. Um, I would not call this warm and cozy. I would not call this, it's a very light material, but I wouldn't call it warm and cozy. And then I realized she's in Florida. This is warm and cozy to her. I'm up here in New Hampshire. This is not warm and cozy. This would be something I might wear on a summer night, not on a winter day, but it's a beautiful top. So I digress. I know you don't want to care about the top, but it really is a nice top. I like it. I like how it fits. Um, it's got the long sleeves. It is very comfortable. So I'd say it's comfortable and cozy, but it's all subjective, right? Isn't it? So what I'm getting at is so is mascara. Some people may love this. Some people may love this one better. I don't know. Um, the, the dupes that this is for, the high-end dupes, I couldn't tell you because I don't use those brands. I do like this one better than this one. So when I do, when I say that, if I was going away and I could only bring one mascara and it was going to be drugstore, it would be this one right now. I really am pleased with it. So it's held up. I come home and, and right now I've been, it's been on my eyes. Oh my gosh, I don't have my watch on right now. But it's been on my eyes all day from early in this morning. And the other thing I have on my eyes, I'm not even gonna talk about that, but I have that little milk crayon on my eyes, little purple one under my, I love it. I think it looks so pretty. I'll talk about that in another video. But this mascara has held up a real long time all day. It hasn't flaked, it hasn't smudged off, and that's what I was worried about, you know? I was worried about it because like, if you don't know how mascara is going to hold up and you're out, you're teaching, you're in public, you're talking to people, and if you have mascara smudging all down your cheeks, it's going to be awful, right? It's going to be awful. So for me, on my lashes, this has been really good. It's held up awesome. I love how it's built up my lashes. I did put, I did the one coat in the pictures. I put a second coat on. I think I did three, three dips. And that's okay. That's normally. Normally I do three or four in this as well. I just, I'm a heavy mascara user. You may not be, but I am. But does this give me those Instagram eyes? No. No. It is not going to give me those Instagram lashes I see on Instagram or the ones I see on Facebook. Is this a nice mascara? I think so. I like it. I'll use it. I'll continue to purchase it. I like this as well. So... I think these are both really good mascaras. Difference in price is, is minor. I bought those myself. I'm, obviously, none of, these, none of this was sent to me. But I was just like really excited about the mascara, so I wanted to share that with you.